Hi, this is KajuD992. I'm going to make a quick program. You can just watch me make it. And maybe I'll just explain how it works in a different video. We're going to be using the debug in the command prompt. And it's going to be made in assembly since that's what debug's meant for. Okay, I will now shut up and just program. Okay, I just wrote the program. It's very simple. All it does is print hello my YouTube friends on the screen. And it doesn't pause the program and wait for you to press enter or anything. It just prints it. Okay, <laughs> now I'm going to compile it. I really don't know which number goes there. I'm just going to put 42. Then writing, then compiling the program with the quiz, and let's check out what I made. I'm going to clear the screen first. Okay, let's see, get rid of echo, echo off. That's, that's much cooler. Now, okay, now we're going to check out what's the program called again? Oh, yeah, hello. Hello.com. Ta da, it works. Now, I don't know why. Oh, that's why. I'm going to start typing right here. Okay, hello, my YouTube friends. That's my simple program I made in assembly, right before your eyes. People that understand assembly would see this. And if they'd learn, I don't know what they're going to learn from it. Okay, <laughs> so I'm going to actually go back to the debug. Now... Oh wait, no, let's quit. I'm going to show you what you can also do with debug. Now debug hello dot... hello dot... Now let's check out what this is gonna do. You can you're gonna see up oh, so if you can hear me my mic kind of falling away from my face. Kind of annoying. Hi. Okay, sorry for that. Um now we're gonna go unassemble at one hundred. And let's see, oh you can see our program I wrote. Uh move DX zero one zero eight move AH09 int up 21 and then return operation to the operating system now right here is just a db command and then a whole entire word well the hello blah 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 okay so right here let's see right here you can actually see this the hexadecimal values it says now it's pretty interesting now the move dx is actually B A in so the opcode for move dx move this value to dx is B A zero eight zero one. Now you can see that they inverted zero eight and zero one there. It's just interesting because then you can see code and take this code right here. And if you want to see more of the code you just go unassemble it, let's say one uh, oh eight, and you can see all the code from one oh eight down. Okay, now, so you can take this code right here and put it into a program that, let's say, QBasic, and that uses hex values all of a sudden to p do something that's faster, like since everyone knows that machine code is faster than QBasic, obviously. Or other things like that. Okay. That's all I really have to show you right now. Nothing else really fun about this. 
So I'm going to stop recording. See ya.